Well, the UP had a harsh climate, or does have a harsh climate for gardening. And for your Facebook story today, you wanted to know which plants can make it and which ones can't. TV6's Anna Samofska spoke with an expert, and she joins us now with more. Anna? Steve, if you're an avid gardener, you should know that some flowers and plants simply aren't cut out for this area. But you may not know why. It can be a harsh winter for a rose in the UP. Lawn specialists say different thorns grow in different zones. Here's how it works. The nation's climate ranges in zones 2 to 11. It's a hardiness zone for the plants that are sent into different locations so that those plants will grow in those particular areas. In the UP, we have a few. Zones 3, 4, and 5. Plants must fall in one of those categories. On Facebook, many of you say lilies, tulips, and daffodils thrive in your gardens. Linda Schwaki says my mother-in-law used to plant daffodils all over. They still pop up and stay pretty even through the snow. That's because most of them are zone 4 plants. They can sustain temperatures of 30 below freezing. These calla lilies are great in the springtime, but even they can't survive the cold of a UP winter. But if you've already planted them in your garden, experts suggest a very simple task to keep them going for next year. Simply remove the soil Oil, remove the bulb of the flower, dry it, and keep it handy to plant for next season. Any of those plants that are all zoned for will grow here at no problem. Don't have to cover them, don't have to wrap them, don't have to do anything. The deer could. Steve shrub roses have a better chance of survival, but most patented roses just won't make it out alive. At Lowe's, they suggest speaking to a garden specialist before deciding which plants to grow.